Hey guys, back again, and today guys is just a quick video update guys, um, so, I've, to start off with guys, I haven't uploaded anything for a while guys, and the reason that is, I've just taken a little bit of a break guys, and trying to, um, what's the word I'm looking for, can I kind of like figure out what I want to do guys, I've got a plan, but so far this year is not going as fast as I want it to be going guys, not as in like the day's going fast, but like, where I want to be already in this year, guys. You get what I'm saying? If I sound a bit funny, guys, do apologise. I've got a fucking abscess. So, at the moment... Oh, I tell you, my eyes turned to shit at the moment with that. But, yep. Surprised the wife this morning, guys, with the old Valentine's Day. She thought I'd forgotten, but I'll know. Nope. I never forget, guys. Never forget. But, it's funny, because normally... The funny story, guys, is we normally talk about it. Like, you know, we always have a lead up to it. Uh, we're like, you know, we talk about, like, what I'm going to get her, or idea-wise, and that lot, but this time, guys, I went completely off the radar, and, uh, I wouldn't talk to her about anything, and then I just surprised her the day, I know it's the 13th today, but I wanted to make sure she got them on, you know, before the day, because I didn't want her to be left out and that lot, no woman should be left out on Valentine's Day if you're loved by somebody, you know, at the end of the day, so, like I said, I wanted to get get her some bits, but yeah, anyway guys, these in, in these in front of me guys are for a reason, a part of the video, so, picked up King Kong guys on the Xbox 360, because I don't know about anybody else, but I personally love this game guys, I think it's a great game, and unfortunately, it was only released on the PS2, the, the GameCube, uh, original Xbox and the 360, and if you want to play the best version of the game, you're going to need to get the 360 version. This is my second copy, guys. I've got a bit of bad luck with this one. This one's mint. It's like brand spanking new. So I'm thanking hallelujah for that. Because my first copy, guys, came like this. And uh, I don't know what they've done to it. But as you can see, half the... um, Yeah. I don't know, guys. But just to quickly show you what I mean, guys. Like If you look through it, you can actually see through it, guys. So, yeah, that's the main reason why uh, I got it again, because it wouldn't read. It really wouldn't read. So, obviously, all the data's gone on it. I don't know why it happened like that, guys. But, yeah, so, got rid of that. Got it again, guys. And like I said, this one is mint. It's even got its manual, guys. It's complete. So, it's got the, the disc. It's got the manual. I actually come with two manuals, so can't complain of that, guys. But, moving on, guys. We got... The reason I want to show these ones off, guys, is because I can't believe the condition of these ones. I mean, that was, like, new anyway, yeah. But they did state it was, like, new. But these ones came from Music Magpie, guys. And both of these games still have the original, like, seal on the side. I used to do that for my games. And these games are absolutely mint, guys. I'm really surprised because this game's getting on in age. And most people don't look after their 360 games. That's why I'm always uh, really reluctant to buy too many 360 games. But I'm mainly trying to collect the exclusives or the upgraded versions that you can only get on the 360 mainly. So that's why I'm getting these. I've got a few other games, guys. I've got like Saints Row 1, which is also only available on Xbox. Though I think some people said it was available in America on PS3. I'm not sure if that's true or not, but, you know, Test Drive Unlimited again. I know it's on PlayStation 2, but the best version is on the 360 or PC. And I, I don't really play PC games too much, so I got it for the 360. Again, it's like new, and I'm very happy because I love that game. It's brought back a lot of memories for me. And the other game I got, guys, is for the original Xbox. Now, I've got a few original Xbox games over time, guys, and I will be showing you uh, the full collection when we uh, get sorted out. But I have to show this one off, guys, because this game was stupidly cheap. I got this off eBay, guys, for £2.80p. No postage, and it's absolutely mint, guys. I mean, check this out. You get the manual and all that, which is fair enough. But, like, look at this disc absolutely min. I'm like, £2.80, you could have got a lot more than that for it, but, you know, I'm grateful, I'm grateful, it's not a great game, you know, it's not like, worth the money, but you could have at least got a fiver for that in that condition, guys, I'm very happy about that, um, I want to also say, guys, to the person, I've forgotten your name, dude, I'm very sorry, I'm not, I'm not good with names, but I remember you told me I had, you wanted me to pick up Jet Set Radio, you recommended that was a great game on the Xbox, I haven't forgot, I really haven't forgot, um, that's the thing, guys, yeah, when people do tell me things, I don't forget, I don't forget, like, things like that, I'm just not very good with names, but I do remember you said to me to get 
Jet Set Radio for the original Xbox. And I, I haven't forgot, dude. I will be picking that up at some point. I'm probably doing some gameplay on that, guys, when I get my Elgato. But, you know, I know people are probably sick and tired of hearing about the Elgato. And they're like, fucking hell, by the time he gets it, it the whole world will like, enjoy like, fucking marvellous. He got it. I will get it, guys, I promise. But um, it's just a matter of waiting at the moment. But look at this. There's actually pretty good graphics for the age of this game. Really looking forward to playing it, to be honest. I think the Xbox really did well with the with the first person shooting games and the third person shooting games and that in general. I think the original Xbox really did well on that. But there's a couple of games on there that are what they were called cheesy. And I still like them guys. One of them games is the Bruce Lee game. I actually I've got that game, so that's really cool. Um stuff like that. But yeah, but to to people that do leave comments, don't think I just brush over it guys and 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 forget what you've said guys. I do remember. I really do remember. Um so, I do appreciate it, and I will be getting Jet Set Radio for the original Xbox. But I remember this, just, just remember, because FHM, who remembers the FHM magazine? That was a weird magazine. You used to get, like, titties and shit, as well as movies and stuff. I think that's the right magazine. I probably got that fucking wrong. <laughs> still, but anyway, guys, hilarious. But I just thought I'd want to bring you up to speed, guys, and explain, you know, I haven't made any videos on games and that, guys, because... My mouth's been playing me up, guys. I got a severe abscess. Yesterday was fucking really bad for me. Um, I'm using antibiotic fucking mouthwash and everything a minute to try and get rid of it. But, you know, today has not been too bad. It was a good day because obviously I wanted to surprise my wife. I've known it was been the pipeline, but, like, it weren't the best day because of my bloody mouth, you know. I was hoping to be able to, to you know, give her a, a bit more excitement. But today I was, you know, but I'm grateful I got not as bad a amount, amount of pain in my mouth, guys, if it makes much sense to you. I'm a bit loopy at the minute with it, but oh, I tell you, I've been I had a high temperature and everything with it last night, guys. I felt like I was fucking hallucinating and that. I'm like, really bad. But uh, I've been um doing what I can to get the infection under control with that, so hopefully, you know. I don't know about anybody else who ever suffers with toothaches and stuff, but when that comes to abscess for me, guys, it's quite a common thing with uh, one of my teeth. It's always getting it, and I fucking hate it, but at the end of the day, I, I, I fear the dentist, guys. People might laugh at that, but I just don't like needles, chairs, stuff like that, no. And people can laugh also because I've got tattoos, but it's not the same bloody thing, guys, for me. But you know, I thought I'd make a random video, guys, you know, trying to make a little bit of sense. I mean, you, you know, this channel is more about video games and stuff, guys, so I want to show you guys what I picked up and also why I picked these games up and so on and forth, guys. But like I said, I there is going to be a lot more retro game related stuff up on the channel guys over time i am going to be doing a lot of new games as well just bear with me guys i'm very much appreciated for people bearing with me i know i'm not the best out there at doing this and i know my channel is extremely slow guys i'm i'm made for people that just like things laid back and raw um you know obviously there's a, a lot lot better channels out there guys but i really do appreciate and consider people uh, still sticking with me as well because even though I might be doing the same thing six months later I, I hope I give you it from a, a disabled person as well as Someone on a different spectrums opinion guys is probably what's what it is But uh, I, I do appreciate it guys and there is a lot of things happening in the background all good things guys It's just slow. You know, what I mean, I want to like I want to rare guys I'm raring to go But I can, there's nothing me and the wife can do at the moment until it happens So you just have to bear with us guys, but you know, I'm gonna, I am gonna get an Elgato, I know I keep bringing it up, I am gonna get one, guys, I promise I'm gonna get one, then I'm gonna be doing gameplays on, like, you know, all consoles, guys, all consoles, and Xbox, and that, especially the Forza Horizon games, and that, guys, I love them, you know, the Forza games, and that, we can do a career mode, guys, you can watch me play through, and that, like, help me make some cars and stuff, we can do Forza Horizon 5, Forza Horizon 4, 3, 2, 1, uh, all the games, guys, we'll have a lot of fun, bring some nostalgia, I'm trying to get better with my talking as well in games, guys, I do apologise, and the, another thing is, guys, if you, you've been watching the Callisto project. I still haven't got past that bit yet, guys. I really haven't got past that. Uh, once I do, I will start recording gameplay again from there. I'm hoping I can get past it because I'm. If you didn't remember, I got left on a really shitty hangar there, but I got no health and I was a lot of enemies. So I've still got to do that, guys. But like I said, um, to everybody, you know, subscribe to the channel and do leave your comments, guys. I really do appreciate it. Um, you know, I do bring up the fact that I'm disabled every time I do a video, guys, and the main reason that is is because I think people under doesn't understand that sometimes it's a lot for me to do this, and I enjoy doing it, guys, I really do enjoy doing it, it's a hobby, it's, but, I, but I appreciate it, it gives me something to look forward to doing on a daily basis, 
And I've been really looking forward to showing you guys the Xbox 360 pickups and the Xbox pickups. But I've been trying to hold off, guys, to show you in more of a better way. But, you know, I just thought I'd make a video, explain to people what's going on and why my videos are still slow and still in the same as they've been for the last, say, three years. Guys, I do apologise. It's just that I'm waiting, guys. When this all goes to where it should be, guys, it will make sense. And you guys will be like, oh, yeah, cool, that's awesome. And you'll see the content will get better. I'm not sure how good I will be at editing stuff and that, guys. Guys, but my content will be better. It'll be different a variety of games. It'll be different pickups. It'll be different everything, guys. And you'll see a change in me and that, and you'll see the difference, guys. So hopefully you uh you hold on for that, guys. But in the meantime, guys, all I can say is thank you very much. I appreciate every single one of you. I don't care what colour you are, what size you are, what height you are, what gender you are, whatever, guys, right? I appreciate everybody. I really do. So at the end of the day, you know, just just be happy. And I'm happy for everyone else as well in the world that you know, does what they want to do, because that's what it's about at the end of the day, guys, if that didn't make much sense, what I just said, basically, what I was trying to say is, you know, just be happy with what you're doing in life, guys, you know, if you're not happy in your job, but you have to have that job, don't panic, because later in life, you'll find it'll go your way, it will, it really will, it really, really will, I keep reading all negative things about war, and people passing away, and people ending their life, and that, and then, you know, no, 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 it's not the way to go, trust me, trust me, no one's life will stay where it was. You will get better. You will. It will. It always does, guys. It always does. What goes up must come down, no matter how you look at it. And whenever you're in a rough place, no matter what it is, something has always happened for a reason, and it will always turn to good somewhere along the line. And I don't care how bad or how dark something is, there's always a light somewhere there. You might not see it there and then, but there's always a light. Always. So, remember that, guys. But, like I said, I do appreciate people holding out on the channel. And I just want to make this video, guys, to show you what I picked up. You make a little video on it, guys, and explain what's going on, guys, and that. Like, it's all good stuff, guys. All good stuff. But I haven't made a video for this week. Because like I said, I've been in a lot of pain with my tooth, guys, and that. And I'm trying to make my content and my videos a little bit better, guys. So, just hold out for that, please. And I'm hoping, you know, I'll get better with it. So, yeah. But, in the meantime, guys, literally, thank you very, very much for watching, guys. Um, comment all that lot, guys, if you want to. Let me know down below, guys, if you want to see something else on the channel when I get around to doing it, guys. And in the meantime, guys, thank you very much for watching. I'm going to go and now rinse my mouth out again with my mouthwash. And I'll see you all in the next one.